Uh, how much was that ankle bothering you um, at all tonight? I know you toughed it out a lot. Mm -hmm. It wasn't bothering me. Any of the athletes, Jaime, uh, Jules, or Johnny, um, you guys had a, a three-point lead in a, in a game that saw 14 lead changes. I know you haven't looked at the film, but when you look back uh, at those last two minutes, what's going through your mind? Um, just do whatever it takes to get a win and get a stop. I mean, that's, that's our mentality. Um, but, you know, obviously that's not how it went. Um, they, they had players who made big shots and big plays. And, um, yeah, but, I mean, whenever we're in that position, we're always thinking stay solid on defense, get a stop, and get, and get a rebound. But it's not how it went. Johnny, the, the Sam Conn and Sports Illustrated, all Bruins. Uh, there's been a lot of talk the past couple of weeks about how, how close you guys are as a team. Obviously, you had that big run last year and then a couple of wins this year in the tournament. Can you just kind of reflect on how close you guys were and, and how that impacts how you react after a tough loss like this? Yeah, uh, it makes it, I think, really tough. And it makes it really hurt because you know, you love playing with this group and for it to end like the way it did, uh, it hits. So, yeah, I mean, it, it was, I felt like we had a real chance to do something really big. So it's just unfortunate. Um, we all love playing with each other and playing for coach. So, yeah, it sucks. Tark Patel from the LA Daily News. Coach Cronin, just uh, Caleb Love, 27 points in the second half. Can you just? Questions for the student athletes. Oh, I'm sorry. Jules, Ber maybe for Jules Bernard, uh, Caleb Love in the second half played really well, had 27 points. Can you just talk about trying to stop him? I mean, he's he's a great player, and um, I feel like he got he got some uh, some good looks early and and, and knocked him down. And uh, you know, when you give a player like that, you know, good looks and, you know, he starts knocking them down and getting a the rhythm. Uh, they, they can get hot and uh, in this tournament, you know, uh, one hot player um, can can send you home and, you know, he's he's a great player and he made some he made some tough shots, but, you know, I, I, get, I give credit to him, but, yeah. One more for the student athletes up front. You guys, um, the game. Speak up, please. I'm sorry, Ben Bosch, Los Angeles Times. Um, the game seemed to swing on that kind of crazy inbound save that Baycott made. Um, what did you see? I mean, did that seem like that obviously sparked the, for Jaime, just that sparked their run, obviously. They made a, a really nice play there to kind of spark what they did. Yeah. Um, <coughs> yeah, that play was a crucial play, I think, down the stretch. Um, you know, they got hot. Uh, sorry, I don't know if that noise is. Um, but, yeah, they got hot. They started making tough shots. And that happens like that sometimes. It is what it is. Gentlemen, thank you very much.